of you tried this new product? It's an Apple Logger. It's uh, voted best new product 2015 by Canadian Living. This is way more fun than those Olympic ones. The ones that are for Olympics are like so lame. I love this filter. It's cute. Anyone else do this thing where they get their groceries done really late because they slept in and then they eat dinner really late? Now it's almost midnight. I don't think this filter is working. I don't see any difference. My forehead's so shiny. Why can't this be my everyday filter? Somebody please come up with filters so that we don't have to do makeup and hair anymore. I don't know, Apple or... Somebody needs to invent like a hologram that you just wear every day. Honestly, I have nothing to snap about today. You see this guy? See him back there on my window? This, this guy? This guy? He showed up a few years ago. If you go over to my YouTube channel, you can see it when it was fresh. YouTube, I'll put my address right here to screenshot it. Okay, so you have to rummage through my videos a little bit to find it. I don't remember what the name of it was, but you'll see it. The cover picture is that. Now what happened is, one day we woke up and it was there. There's some kind of condensation or it got in between the thermal layers of glass. And it made that creepy thing. And at first it used to look like what we would think of today as like an image of Jesus. And now it looks like a weird Bigfoot. Okay, so you can see it on my patio door, right? And it really is just like, it's in the glass. You, you can't clean it off. In the holiday times, my daughter came over here and put these sticky plastic things on my window for the kids. So these things are these like things, cling film that, it's just like a little Christmas light, but now it's his eyes. And some people don't believe me, they think that I put it on here, but let me just rub this for you, look. It's actually in between the layers of glass. So we really want to change this patio door, but we're almost going to miss this strange oddity when we actually do change it. It's like seven feet tall. Okay, you want to know what's in my fridge? Let's have a look. We got some yellow, orange, red peppers, like about ten of them. Sure, we got some tomatoes, nectarines, and lots of lemons. Um, this is Pat's Coke. A bag of carrots and some eggs, two containers. I always, we always double because Pat brings it to work with him. He's a truck driver, so he has his own food. This drawer has some green stuff. Cucumbers, pears, green peppers. Up here I have my bean sprouts and my zucchinis. This is a container of chicken, another container of chicken, sausages, and hamburger. Pat's going to cook that up to bring to work with him for his lunch. These are all my cucumbers. I easily eat two or three of these cucumbers every day. This is from a compost bin. This is my daughter's juice. I got some coconut oil back here and some tamari sauce. All these little bottles like capers and ghee and olives and pickled onions and sriracha and Worcestershire. This mayonnaise is almost empty, but then there's like raspberry coulis sauce, vinegar, pickles, some chow chow. What is chow chow, you might ask? It's a homemade ketchup, usually made in Quebec, with tomatoes and fruits. Every morning I grate some of this ginger and I squeeze half this lemon into a cup, add boiling water, and I make an infusion. It's my tea. One time, my daughter Winter broke a glass, and then she found almost every single piece and glued it back together and painted the inside. There's a kitty on my balcony. Do you see her? Hello, kitty. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I'm going to back off. No, you can go ahead. Sometimes I get um, cats or raccoons on my back balcony because I have a dog pen outside and I leave my dog food in there overnight and they come to eat it. I am a huge animal lover, and I believe that, um, you know, when animals are hungry and there's no food left, leave something outside for them. 
rainy day. Gotta stay indoors. Great day for a movie. My granddaughter Amiel cleaned the windows for me Even after she one. drew on them. Now she's putting the guy's eyes back on. There go. Remember when you were a kid and you just did this all day? You having fun? Yeah. And now you're a grown up and all you do is this all day? I hate this. <laughs>